Okay, pizza review time, Antico Casa. Now, if my memory serves me correct, and my memory always serves me fucking, yep. The unboxing, this goldfish, this fucking jerk. Um, uh, I don't know why I said jerk. That made no sense. This shirt, this goldfish necklace, I'm never taking off. Anyway, back to the pizza room. Antico, if I recall, a very well-known pizza place in Atlanta, probably the most popular in Atlanta. I ate there, I thought it was good. It was fancy pizza, if I remember. This is where everyone said, Antico, Antico, Antico. Big review. It's very good. I like the pizza a lot. Very floppy. Eight three. Also, don't say sold out, but we got a sponsor here finally um, for the pizza reviews at home. Pay the bills. All my slobs not working. Somebody's got to pay them. Owens Craft Mixers. So here's what you do. I already put some vodka in here. I'm, I, I'm pretty sure this is not a twisty. Ladies, keep it together. Um, so you take this. There you go. And, and it's a pre-made drink. So what did I go with? They got a bunch of different flavors. I went with mint, mint cucumber and lime. Uh, anything cucumber, I'm a cucumber guy. Now, this is the first time I've ever done it. So I'm assuming, like, it'll be a one-drink size in this glass, which is, like, just a standard drink glass. And did Dave do it again, or did Dave do it again? A perfect, and I mean, slightly perfect pour. Let's give it a shot. Oh, delightful. It's like a mojito type situation. Put a little leaves in there and go a little cha-cha-cha and you're fucking out in Cuba. You can go to Cuba now. Now back to the pizza. So shout out to these guys for getting involved. I'll probably guzzle this in the break. All right, pizza review time. We are have uh, Antico Casa. Looks pretty good. And I got to, I got to, first of all, Look at this fucking thing. I got this in the unboxing. They called it a pizza destroyer. It's fucking heavy. I'm going to destroy the fuck out of this pizza. Actually, let's just fucking destroy. Get this in here now. Fucking see, if, you know, the other thing. Oh, good crunch here. You know, this thing looks good, but that other device I had was a lot easier. The rock and forth one, the, the uh, pirate ship. But if I put my logo on something, homemade, ah, shit's everywhere. It's just fucking, I've lost my mind. Um, I'll use it. So Pizza Antico, interesting. I saw the thing. It's a preheat oven to 425. I did that like so. I'm a pro. I didn't read all the directions. This is the first one I said. Preheat oven at 425, place on pizza rack for six minutes, set oven to broil for one minute to finish until cheese is creamy, crust is crisp, but not burnt. This thing took way more than six minutes, and I did not read the broil. The broil is a great little trick. I didn't read it, so I didn't do the direction. So that's on me. Hand hand up. That's on me. Follow, follow me. Jeff Bagwell, uh, uh, follow on me. Yeah, Bagwell also. Um... Unboxing. Before I eat this, real quick. Speaking of the unboxing, the most bananas email exchange I've ever had. So I did the unboxing. If you guys watched it yesterday, um, and somebody sent like a stripper, a, a, a escort, kids show. Someone just called. Did someone just call a stripper? That had to be it, right? Some chicks like, hey, it's Madison. I'm here. I'm like, what? So like, you didn't just call me? No. I would have had her fucking come up, but it's like, I can't even get to the phone. I couldn't see it. I thought it was food. So like, how much were you supposed to get paid? Yikes. All right. Um, all right, here, I'll, I'll, I'll come down. Yeah, it's fucking weird. If you can wait, I'm almost done with this and I can just pay it and then you can go. But I, I need like 15 minutes. Turned her away, paid her, whatever. But someone's faking to be me out there now and is like pretending to be a hooker. So I had a hooker. She's like, hey, I saw your thing. Is this you? Do you want me to come over? I'm like, it's not me. It's a fake me. She's like, oh, all right. So you don't want me to come over. No. Then she's like, oh, I'm a big fan. Uh, I went to Fordham. Any interest in like hiring for a finance job? So uh, hooker, no. No, we're not hiring for finance. Then she's like, do you still want me to come over tonight? I'm like, no. Then she said she thought I was hilarious. Am I single? This all happened in four, four to five emails, DMs. Hey, do you want the hooker? No. Is this a fake profile? Yes. Are you hiring at Barstool? No. Um, are you single? What a world. One bite, everybody knows rules. Antico, good bottom crust right there. That was just story time. You know, oh, and also look at this. Look at the stuff I'm getting. A goldfish, a little Randolph necklace. Fire. 
Um, this boy is fire, fire burning on the dance floor. A lot of fire songs. This review. I'm not on Adderall. I'm not on the white stuff. I'm just going too fast. Oh, this is very good. This is very good. Another very, very good frozen pizza. I mean, it's very good. You could tell me I was in a, in a pizza uh, restaurant. I wouldn't, I wouldn't blink twice here. Is it better than yesterday's? Mm, not for me. But that's because I don't like the style more than New Haven style. Um, but this is great. I'm going to hit this with a 8-3. I mean, this is real deal. Antico, this is real deal frozen pizza. No other way around it. No other way to jive it. No other way to shake it. Get in Owens, mix his drink, do this. But this is... I'm finding some good pizza places. And they deliver. They're frozen. Get you through quarantine. This is the real deal shit right here. Antico in Atlanta. 8-3. Woo! Give it to him, Jeff.